Hey, so this is just like a quick montage of what a day at SJT was like during my summer study abroad program in Shanghai like two years ago. But um, yeah, this is me leaving the dorm and um, going outside. Ugh, it was always so humid. But um, yeah, here's the sea of bikes and somewhere in it is mine. It's crazy how much we had to bike here. <laughs> oh, there it is. And someone else's bike had to fall on it. <laughs> but here are some like breakfast foods before class. And this was my French professor. Um, he didn't actually teach French, but he taught computer security, but he was French and his accent made my day whenever I had his class. And then this is the cafeteria and everything was so cheap. Like every meal was probably a dollar, two dollars, three dollars at most. dumplings and this them. And the bubble tea was so cheap. But um, after class, like we would just go to the library on campus, more bikes. Um, <laughs> but whenever you go into the library, you have to scan your ID, but then also scan your face. I guess they wanted to check that you were who you really said you were. Oh yes, these escalators. They did not work the entire summer, I guess. The school wanted to save on electricity or something. I don't know, man, but here we are um, with some snackos from the convenience store downstairs. And then right outside was um, like kind of like a strip mall, but just of, I guess it was more like shops full of food, but this pancake was so good. And then more bubble tea. <laughs> Probably had bubble tea like three times a day. Sometimes we would just grab a really big room and study together and drink our bubble tea and you know write all over these screens. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that whenever the library wanted to kick us out, they would just turn on this music <laughs> to let us know that they're closing. And then after, you know, the library's closed, you just go back to the dorms because everything closed super early, but um, yeah, that's it. Thanks for watching.